Yo, what's good? Let's check out episode 10 of Mushoku Tensei. Now, you already know the YouTuber things, but if you want to talk about anime and manga, follow me on Twitch and Twitter at Joe Freshest. Links in the description below. And if you want to check out any of my other reactions for this series, you can click this link right up here. It'll take you to that playlist, though I don't just do reactions for this series. I do reactions for a ton of others, and you can find those in the playlists on the channel. So a few things before we actually get into the reaction. The first being the fact that... This was obviously recorded a long time ago. In fact, these were recorded on the day that the episode aired. So that Sunday that episode nine aired, that's when the recording occurred. Like that's, you know, these are these are old. Uh, so keep that in mind. Everything that you're gonna say in the comments has already been said. <laughs> so uh, be, by all means, like go ahead and say everything in the comments. You can see that the background totally different. All right, so just keep that in mind that these are a bit older. Also, if you're interested in watching the full-length reactions for all of the Mushoku Tensei episodes in the second part of the first season, so everything in the fall 2021 season, make sure that you join our Patreon. Link will be in the description below, and you can check out the full-length reactions before the edited versions ever go on YouTube. Those full-length reactions will go up on the Patreon, so you can check those out. Yeah, consider it if that's something that you might be interested in. Also, if you're interested in light novel readings, I am currently reading through Kumodesu, so so I'm a spider, so what? I'm reading through that on Twitch, twitch.tv slash joefreshest. If you come by on Sundays, Midday, we're still working out the time, probably around 2 p.m. Eastern. We will be reading through that. Lastly, if you have something to say that will contain a spoiler, then please use a spoiler tag. And what I mean by that is in a very brief sentence, in quotes, address what you'll be talking about with your spoilers, skip a line, type the word spoilers, skip six lines, type out your spoiler comment, and what everyone's gonna see is your very brief sentence in quotes, addressing what your spoilers will be about. Obviously, no spoilers in that sentence. You'll see the word spoilers and read more. If they click read more, they can see your spoilers if they don't click it they won't get spoiled and the last thing i want to say is i love mushoku tensei this is a great series great story there the characters are very interesting rudy hard to root for because he's kind of shitty to start but i imagine that especially with the last few episodes he's starting to understand a little bit you know starting to grow more as a person and i believe that this second core will only go to show that he is growing as a person see how he is changing animation beautiful story seems good so far and i cannot wait to check out that second core so make sure you're subscribed to the channel if you want to check out those reactions for the fall 2021 season and make sure you join the patreon if you're interested in the full lengths two episodes ago we had it end with uh, Eris and Rudy being transported to the Demon Continent. Last episode, we saw them in the Demon Continent. They met a new friend, uh, Rujard, who is a... Spared. So, pretty much, Rujard is... He's like the last of his kind, and he wants to set the record straight on his people. He wants to represent them better and make the world realize that his people aren't bad people, dude. They were fooled into doing bad things that they couldn't control themselves um and it caused them to just get this horrible uh um, stigma everyone that's the word everyone sees them in, in a bad light when really it wasn't much that they could do about that so his goal is to do that and rudy says i got you bro i'm gonna help you and so rujard is now helping eris and rudy get back home and in the process rudy and Eris will be helping him to redeem his people. There we go. Let's go check out this episode. Oh, cool. This is what we saw from the trailer. Damn. She eating dog, bro. She basically eating dog. Ew! No, 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 don't do it! Ooh, no! Ooh. Mm. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's nasty, dude. Yeah, I would want rice and beef too, dude. A little. Oh, dude, he basically ate like a maggot or a worm. Mm. No, never. Good. Animation's a little choppy there. But I think the staff is like. It's not like a large staff that works on this, which is surprising because, dude, some of the stuff that they do is is phenomenal. Phenomenal. Like, large teams of people can't even do the stuff that they do sometimes in this. Oh, 
Bro, why are you yelling like that, bro? If you meet him, you die. Wow. Wow. Wow, that's an interesting city design. I really like it. Whoa, why is this building so different from those buildings? Bro, that's where the rich people live or something? This is very interesting. I like this. Uh-uh. Never. No shot, chief. I ain't eating no insects. I guess, you know what? If I lived in this world, I'd probably just have to, <laughs> have to nut up and just eat the damn insects. Hey, there you go, Eris. Look at you, little cutie. Oh, no, my man is getting broke. Yeah, this must be where the rich people live. Up in that beautiful, like, obelisk, uh, uh, ob obelisk? No, uh, like, um, what's the word I'm looking for, man? Onyx. I think that's the word I was looking for, like, onyx? Isn't that like a black gem? They dyed his hair. Ah, they dyed his hair and probably put a headband on him or something. <laughs> oh, I love it, dude. That's good. Oh, so he was testing them. What is this triple titty? <laughs> kind of, what kind of, what kind of shit is this, bro? Trip nip. <laughs> mm. So they gotta like choose like E ranks or something. So the only reason he said all that shit was so that way he could find out whether people saw him as a superior or no, or, or not. Oh, you realize? Yeah, you better stop, froggy boy. Yeah, that's the whole reason he did it. He wanted to show uh, Riger that that. You know, he's not going to be seen as a, um, as a spared. Ah. 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 What is this? Hey, yo, what the fuck? What is it? Why does it look like that? Yo, Eris, bro, you need to chill, bro. Bad girl, what is wrong with you, Eris? Jesus. <laughs> I love it, dude. I love Rudy, dude. He's fucking hilarious. Kurt! <laughs> oh, I need no airways. It's okay, Eris. We could sew the button back home. Little past life action here. Oh, hey, look who it is. What up, homie? <laughs>
<laughs> what is this, dude? Very interesting. Okay. 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 We'll take the kitten job. Nah, man. You just listen. Listen, dude. This is um, human kami. Listen, bro. Y'all gonna get mad at me for not knowing the name of them. Okay. Come on, Ares. Of course. What you mean? It's very interesting that Rijer has like this uh, ability. That's because what's in there are animals. <laughs> what the shit? Yeah, this looks like some sort of dungeon where they keep animals and shit. I don't know. Kitty. Oh, that is not just a kitty, bro. Oh. Sinking floor. <laughs> Everybody gets their ass whooped. Getteth wrecketh. Damn, you don't play. Give me that same animation, that scary animation. Give it to me, please. Please. Damn, Eris ain't even, ain't even, she's un, unfazed, bro. Damn. Oh, we heard, man. You, hey, you need to, you need to dial it back, brother. Killing should be a last resort, bro. Yes, bro. Doesn't matter. You killing people. You need to teach him. Try to understand them, man. They just broke, bro. They're just trying to make some money. He sees things like way too like black and white, bro. You got to relax a little bit. It's not always as simple as good and bad. Sometimes, you know, there are gray areas. So doesn't that make you evil? Bitch. Get wrecked. Yes, here we go. Eris with the with the thought-provoking words. Yeah, exactly. You want to be good? Then be good. You about to break this man's shoulder, bro. Can you just relax a little bit, though? Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> just dial it back, brother. Damn. A measly little stone. Ugly fucking Bojack Horseman looking ass, bro. If you don't get out of our face. Bro, why do these episodes end so fast? I hate this crap. I hate this crap. ReZero, bro. Can we get, can we just get more shows like ReZero that are just longer? 
or like F and OP, F and ED, like just, you know, I'll take a 24, 23 minute episode where you just don't have any of that crap. Like I don't need it, bro. I don't need it. And again, I guess they need it. You know, they need to have their credits and stuff. Anyways, let's, let's talk about the episode. Okay. So, um, they snuck Rujard into the, uh, city and they did so by just changing his hair color. <laughs> it, apparently, if you don't have green hair, not as spared. Simple. It's just how it is, dude. You're just not. Rudy buys Eris a little cloak, which is pretty cool. They go into this bar, and he's like, you know, big bro right here. My man's is a, is a, is a spared. And then everybody's like, nah, nah, he's not. Blue hair. And uh, that was just so that he can show Rouger, like, bro, listen. Editor note. It's not just hiding your hair color, it's actually changing how you act on top of that makes people think, oh, well, you're not a spared because those guys are evil. So they sign up as adventurers at the lowest rank and they can only take within one rank of the rank that they're at. So as F ranks, they can only take E rank missions or maybe they're E ranks and they can only take D ranks. I don't know, some crap like that. Anyways, they, they, they take this mission because Rudy has a dream where he talks to the human god and the human god says, Take the kitty finding mission, trust. Big, big kitty, it's like a panther. And then they also find the people that did it. And the whole reason that he's supposed to take that mission is so that he can pretty much barter with this other group of adventurers and have them take C rank missions or B rank missions even because they were at D and they could level up to C. So they he made them level up to C and they're taking B rank missions while Rudy's team is taking taking like E rank missions and he's like, yo, we're just gonna swap, get the missions done, boom. He has a goal in mind of just having this other group and other groups I'm sure in the future, having them all spread good word about dead end. I guess it's like the word that they're using uh, or the term that they're using for um, Rejer the Spare. So if he spreads like good word about dead end, then maybe the, the spared people will like have a better um, standing in society. People will like not see them as bad anymore. I don't know. That's my guess. Like, I don't really know for sure, but kind of like the vibe I was getting. Also, Richard has like some issues, bro. He's like, yo, evil is evil. Good is good. And Eris is like, no, it's not that simple because it's not. Richard is, he sees things in black and white. He's like, you kick a kid, you're evil. Eris kicks Rudy all the time. Does that make her evil? But then you're just creating double standards. Listen, some people, do bad things occasionally because they are in need. They're not out here murdering anybody. They're stealing pets, returning them, making profit. I mean, it's bad. Don't get me wrong. That's still stealing money. You know, that's 100% what they're doing is, is stealing. That is theft. But theft and murder are different. You know, killing people is different from stealing. Richard is the bad guy here. He literally murdered this guy because he kicked Rudy in the stomach. And he's like, he kicked a kid, he's evil. No, it's not that simple, bro. It's not that simple. You killed your family, uh, Rujard. Aren't you a bad guy? No. You know, because it's not that simple. And that's what, that's the whole thing that they're trying to tell him. Calm the fuck down and start learning a more civilized way of thinking, a, a more friendly approach to just situations with anybody because his way of thinking is not very rational. If anything, he's over-rationalizing things. He's like, you do bad thing, you bad. You do good thing, you good. Bigger number, better person. <laughs> it just reminds me, I don't know if you guys watch uh, Ludwig, but whatever. Anyways, man, yeah, he. you do bad thing, you bad person. You do good thing, you good. Easy, but no, it's, it's not easy. Pretty much this episode ends off with Rudy and his gang, you know, telling that other group, you, you know, spread the good word about us. Dead end equal good, not dead end equal bad. And then the, and Horseface, uh, Bojack Horseman comes out and he's all like, eh, 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 eh. and so I, I just hope that guy gets his ass kicked. He's so annoying. Go eat some hay, get out of our face, okay? And that's pretty much how the episode ends. So thoughts going forward, you know, it's just more of the same sort of thing. They need to make their way through this area, through the demon continent. They, I guess they're gonna be in this town for a little bit. There's only one more episode after this episode. So something is going to happen by the end of next episode that is going to be a cliffhanger, I would assume. The, the goal here is 
make money, build up your notoriety within this city uh, and as an adventurer of the demon continent and then move on from the demon continent. You would just move through the continent to new cities, etc. That seems like the goal here. What's gonna happen in the next episode that's gonna like change things? I don't know, maybe a demon king, demon lord, something. That's my guess. I don't think we're meeting the dragon god yet. We're not gonna meet the dragon king yet. Maybe that that pink lolly ish, like the the little re the little um me, uh, Milam. Yeah, maybe maybe we'll meet her, or maybe not. Not really sure how it's gonna play out. But from here, I want to know what you guys thought of this episode. How did you feel about this episode? If you're an anime only, hit me with some thoughts, theories, predictions for the future. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, then like the video and subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss another one. I do anime episode reactions, manga chapter reactions, and reviews on anime and manga once I catch up to or finish a series. So if that sounds like the type of content that you might be interested in, then please do subscribe to the channel. And until next time, Make sure you all keep it fresh. Peace.